Greetings and salutations, Capsuleers. I'm off doing my, my routine, uh, going around picking stuff up, and uh, I actually I, I can't even sell most of this stuff. This is this is getting gotten a little bit out of hand. Um, I open this up, and uh, there's just all sorts of stuff. I mean, I, I keep buying all this. Uh, excess stuff but I don't know if you guys know me very well but I like to go around with the mineral trade and I recently opened up to even buying up ores because I guess some people don't have enough station rep or just sell ores they just sell ores instead of converting them into minerals and doing whatever else I don't know I, all I know is you need this stuff to build things with and I just go around doing the what do you call it trading you know uh, uh, arbitrage or I don't, I don't know I, I, I pick it up from one place and drop it off somewhere else but I can't even do that because prices are, are dropping on some of the stuff because what I do is uh, like I'll, 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 I'll place the order and then I'll wait for the order to fill so I can go off and do other things you know while I'm you know doing all sorts of craziness Come on, get into station. <sighs> it is kind of nice though, because I mean, when when you have a nice little little ship, you know, that can actually go around picking all this stuff up, you know, it gives you a little something to do in, in between. You know, it, I guess it's busy work, but the reward is whenever you can actually sell something for a lot higher than what you bought it for and then it ends up helping the economy out i guess but right now while everything's all getting low and stuff it's like geez all right what, what, what am i working with all right we're only half full Ooh, goody goody um i guess i can go and pick this little shipment up it's only 12 million whatever <laughs> it, it it has become a lot more extra busy work though because not only do you have to pick this stuff up you actually have to go take it to a station that you're really high rep with and refine it there and then then you can like do whatever you want with it um i don't like to resell this i like to convert it into minerals so i can just ship a whole big old shipment over to wherever needs it which, all right, let's go ahead and take a look into some of this stuff. All right, this has gone down like on the buy side of things because what I like to do is I like to dump it into the buyer's market. And that's gone down a little bit. What I'd like to see is it to, to, to go back up to like 100. That would be nice. But I guess, you know, lower prices are a lot better for the people that are actually using it. So, yeah, it is what it is. All I know is I'm buying it for way cheaper. Oh my gosh, actually, I'm not even buying this anymore. <gasps> That's right. Oh wait, hold on. No, I'm still not buying it. But I I guess I would be buying it for like or like 72, which I guess is a good price considering it's selling for 90. So I get a little bit of little bit of profit I guess they raised the the fees and stuff so it's like a little bit harder to even make a little bit extra profit these new changes uh, it, it has made things a little bit more difficult for for trading it's more like they want to take the actual traders out you know like take the traders out and have it be like the people actually producing it doing the selling and whatnot but that even even that's kind of ridiculous you know because that's extra work that other people just don't want to do you know that's why buying it really low and then trying to make a profit that way and the reason you, you do it straight into the buyers is you don't have to pay the the actual broker fee uh, you still got to pay taxes on it so eh, whatever um so it might actually be interesting if I was to go ahead and 
start up some new types of dealings going on. Um, mostly probably just buying it off the sellers and, and holding and then, and then selling it whenever it gets a little bit higher. That's a little bit more risky, but I wouldn't recommend doing it because, I mean, I'd still have to move it. And I mean, it's not like I charge a moving fee, but some of those other guys out there, man, I don't even know. Like, what, what do they do? Just make a contract or something? It's like, geez, come on, man. You can you can do so much better with your time. But I don't know. I, I, I guess haulers just do that. I'm like a... a, a a tycoon hauler you know I do everything on my own and it, it does work out very well OMG alright let's see yeah pick this stuff up ooh that's actually pretty pretty decent it's a little bit more than I thought it'd be I guess picking up low statures of stuff <sighs> If you guys are wondering why I do everything out expert housing, I have the highest rep with those guys. Because apparently, whenever I was doing a mi the mission chain, which was mostly involving uh, going from uh, mission to mission to mission to mission to mission, it actually circled around so I could just do it over and over and over, just not even nonstop. Like, the, the pickup point was the drop off point, new mission, and pickup point was there, new mission at the next drop off, and it just kept going just like that. It was like a vicious cycle. It was it was great, actually. I, I don't know where exactly that is at, unfortunately, so I couldn't tell you, but I know it exists for expert housing. And you just boom, 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 and just get all the rep with them all in one go instead of like hitting up a mission carrier and then flying off somewhere and having to fly back to go to that same mission carrier and flying off somewhere else and heading right back and it's like instead it's just like a, a, a massive circle circular mission just changed over and over and that's that was pretty cool <laughs> um all in all uh, i think i might actually have to start getting back into ships again just to try to see if i can't pry the mineral prices to be a little bit higher unfortunately i don't think i have the funds right now i'd have to really start selling some of this stuff it's quite unfortunate but i mean i, I got my total net worth is only 40 trillion i guess billions trillions something it's something um which I guess would be a lot higher if I didn't actually place bounties on a whole bunch of people, like code. <laughs> but it is what it is. Um, I'm going to have to stop doing that because it really doesn't do anything. It's just funny. Uh, at least I think so. Because <laughs> I still got my huge bounty and it kind of freaks people out sometimes. You're like man you must be really bad like no that just <laughs> just poked the wrong bear <laughs> it, it, it really is what it is um, but hopefully you guys uh, have a little bit of fun doing this stuff um, I will say this like buying up some of the the lower level the level one stuff uh, region wide and then just flipping them at the, the own at the stations whenever they get a, a big enough stack and charging like 10 times the amount I bought it for does seem to work out very well um, you have to really I mean take a look right here like I'm buying these things for like about a thousand selling them for like 20,000 it works I mean it's slow though and you might end up buying a lot more than you actually sell so that's that's kind of the downside of it all but I mean it all happens it, it, you just gotta take things slow it, like just take it slow and build up build up and don't waste your money on on the ridiculousness of crazy stuff and uh, ooh, see look zero percent expert housing boom and unfortunately, I mean, the numbers are kind of a lie. 
in and of itself even if you know I'm buying it for like pre 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 low and it's it's kind of weird the way all the numbers actually crunch together but it, I trade based based off of averages so it kind of all averages out and then hopefully I get a little bit of money off the side I don't know I just don't know hopefully the new broker fees and all these transaction fees and you know, all the increased taxes and, and the loss of margin trading I don't know. Uh, hopefully, this connections things go, go goes back through. Um, I, I don't even understand why they did that, but I just, I, I don't even know. <sighs> Cross my fingers and uh, hope for the best. Um, like, share, and subscribe. Eh? Um, I, I do eat videos every once in a while, but. Apparently, you know, there actually might be some some PvP stuff going down. Like, hopefully, I I'm I'm like skilled up enough. Like, geez, skilled up enough to at least do something. But I have no idea. I've I've I have forgotten how to do. I've forgotten how to do any combat missions. Like, that was back. I was learning back when I first started, and then I got into the trading and been trading for years now, and and mostly just off and on but i'd always come back it kind of it kind of kind of works it works for me <laughs> at any rate um till next time bye